Belt. What's wrong with you? Victor, I just wanted to spend time with my child. You know I could report you to court for kidnapping? Oh, so wait, so if I was not called by the school to be informed that you came to pick her up, I wouldn't have an idea where my child is. Victor, she is my child too, okay? Don't you dare. Oh, well, well, what an incredible parent you are. Huh? Like you drive your eight-year-old daughter around without a sick belt. Jesus Christ. I'm sorry. Hey, have you started using it again? No, I'm not using any stuff. Don't you dare touch me. I am done with this. Come here, princess. Sorry. See, if this ever happened again, I swear to God, I'll take you to court. And I'll take full custody of princess. You'll never see her again. No, 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 no,
the sticks are good. It's good. Thank you. Princess of his left wall. That's good. Princess, thank you, actually, like it. It's hot. Can I get more milk? Milk, yes, yes, please. Thank you, milk. Please. <laughs> I knew that was going to happen. It happened like water. Milk consumers. Problem. More milk coming up. Some more. Oh, please. You think you're a baby? I am like not your baby. Thank <laughs> you. And for you. This is Sonia. That's my love. Will you be here when I get back home to school? Uh, I'm sorry, baby boy. I have a lot to do this week. But don't worry. I'll be back before you know it. Okay. I'm just wondering, why don't you stay with us? <sighs> I'm sorry, baby, but your dad and I are taking things slow, and I'll be here very soon. Yeah, honey. And Sonia's right. Thank you. Okay. I'll go pack your lunch and get you ready. Honey. I am sorry about yesterday, okay? I shouldn't have acted the way I did in front of you. Okay. You know, Daddy had a reason for acting that way. Hmm? Please, I'm sorry. Okay. Whatever happened had nothing to do with you. Okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Please, forgive Daddy. Thank you. Now, eat and let me get your lunchbox, okay? <laughs> Look at my baby. <laughs> Is it? You work so hard, baby. <laughs> now we should be here when I get back. Babe, hey, see, listen. Spend the weekend, at least. We spoke about this, baby. I told you I have a lot on my plate. And you know I work late nights too. Hmm. I know you've been complaining that I barely sleep over. But I'm trying my best to sleep over once in a while. Hmm. Hmm? Oh, that's fine. Because I know where to find you. <laughs> Ew, you guys! <clears throat> um, Daddy, I'm going to be late for school. Oh, yes, um, I'm, I'm so sorry, yeah? Um, my box, right? Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. All the time. <laughs> um, uh, uh, Auntie Sonia had something in her eyes, so I was just trying to. Um, yeah. Help her take it out. Yeah, true. Uh -huh. By licking her eyes? 
Yeah, I, I, I was taking dirt out of her eyes. Yeah. yeah. Auntie Sonia's eyes look perfect to me. Uh, that is because <laughs> um, I removed the dead. Yeah. <laughs> okay, Mr. A Doctor, let's go to school. Yeah, let's go. <laughs> Smart pass. Bye. 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 I'll see you. Yeah. <laughs> hey, please don't start. <laughs> All right, babe. See you. The last I checked, you were in Dubai with your footballer boyfriend. <sighs> well, honey, that relationship has ended. In fact, sit down. In fact, it's ended in Dubai. What happened? What happened? That story for another day. But for now, how's your cute boyfriend and his daughter, Princess? Mm, well, my cute boyfriend and his daughter are doing well. In fact, they'll be here any moment from now. Victor wants to drop her here because he has a lot of work to do today. That's beautiful. <laughs> I get to meet her, right? Yes. It's so long. I'm sure she's a big girl now. Uh, you're right. You know how kids these days go very quickly. I'm sure you wouldn't even recognize her when you see her. Oh, babe, calm down. I've only been gone for one year. One year? One. One year. Yes. One, year. one year is more than enough. I'm telling you what. Really? Yes. <laughs> but I've missed wow. you. Where have you been? I mean, after Dubai. Where? After Dubai. Oh, let me see. After Dubai, I went to London. Yeah, I went to see my family, my mother, my father, my siblings. I haven't seen them in a while. You know, we need to keep up with family. Family is everything. True. Life is too short. Too short. <laughs> That's right. Family is an integral part of us. That's very good. I'm really glad you're making our time for yours. What can I do? <laughs> Babe, I got you something, something, something. Yeah. Where, where? Wait, relax. Uh, can you calm down? I'm not coming from home. I, so just calm where down. Did you, go? you don't want to know. This I girl, you don't go to my house now. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that's oh, that. Yeah. Hold that. You see this thing you got for me? You have to bring it. Stay relax. You need to trust. Relax what? <laughs> babe. You miss me. I miss you too. She's so big, you said it. I told you. Oh, hi, Victor. <laughs> Long time. Yeah. What? How are you doing? Yeah, I'm good. You? you look good. Good to see you. <laughs> Thank you. Come here. Come here, baby. Uh, somebody's about to take my princess too. Yes, I am. <laughs> What are you doing here? Um. I'm here to see my child. Please. Pull her for me. Does Victor know you're here? Besides, how did you find this place? Sonia. You want to stop a mother from seeing her only child? What have I done to you people? Why are you treating me like this? Mm -hmm. Tessa, answer the question. <laughs> I'm 
You are high. Really? You thought you could come here in this state and I would let you see princess. Do better. If not for yourself, for your child. You want to stop me from seeing my child? You're trying to separate me from my child. I am a mother. This is... This is so unfair. Let me see my child. Just go on. I need to see my go child. Go and clean up yourself this minute. You have to leave now. No. My child. Leave. No. Princess, let's go to my room. Leave me alone. I can see my mom anytime I want. But I am not stopping you from seeing I your mom. I said no. My baby. My baby, you know, I, I thought I was not going to see you today. <sighs> Fine. Fine. No. See how she treats me. I'm your mother, and she's not. That's why she's jealous. She took your dad away from me. And now she wants to take you away from me. But why would she want to take me away from you? I don't know. It's because she's jealous. She's jealous of us, our family. Listen, this is supposed to be our home, our house. Me, you, and your dad, together, a happy family. I'm sure she has called your dad so he can chase me away. Listen, my baby. Don't let her separate us. Don't let her take you away from me. You see? Your daddy is back. She called your dad. I don't want to go away. Hi, Princess. Hi, Daddy. Why are you here in Sonia's house? Hey, I do not need your permission on anybody to see my child. Look at you. Look at you. Why would you come to someone else's house? Hi! Hi? Oh. Is that what she told you? Hi? Oh, don't you dare, Tessa. What's all this? Look at you. You're high. And I don't need anyone to tell me that. I just want to see my child. Give your child to me. See, I am not the kind of man who keeps a child from the mother. And I want to do that to my daughter. But you are testing my patience. Please, be careful, okay? And do not let this happen again. Just... No, leave. Leave, leave, leave. Just, just do this and leave. Hey, Francis.
Good morning, Daddy. Good morning, my princess. How are you? I'm fine. Mm. Daddy, are you going to work today? Yes, I'm going to work today. So I'm going to drop you off at Auntie Sonia's place. Mm? But why are you working today? It's weekend. Yes, I have a big presentation and I have some things I need to handle. Well, I don't want to go to Auntie Sonia's house today. Why? You love going to Auntie Sonia's place. Not anymore. Take me someplace else. <laughs> All right. Name it, and I'll take you there. Take me to Mommy's place. That would never happen, OK? Enough of the matter. Well, you are going to Auntie Sonia's place, and that's final. You're not done eating. I'm not hungry anymore. Princess. Princess. I'm coming. Oh, hi, princess. I am sorry about that. She's been like this since the Tessa incident. Yeah. I'm sure she'll come around. But anyway, thank you for agreeing to take her. It's okay. She's still my princess. Yeah. So I will see you when I get back, right? Okay. All right, come here. Let's see you. Okay, let me just see you off. All right. What's this? Let's see. Okay, be a good girl. Okay? Let's see. Hi, princess. What's wrong? Nothing. Fine. Are you hungry? Okay. I'll go make something for you, okay? to get some rest, okay? Okay. Yes, princess. Not a word of this to your father. You're only getting worried. Please.
Hey, babe. Uh, babe. Yeah. Mm, I'm back. Yes, I'm back. <laughs> Are you okay? Mm. I'm just sleepy and tired. Yeah, I am tired as well. I would have loved to crush you today, you know. Oh, not today, please. Why? I I need some alone time. I have a lot of work to do. Well, it's fine. Okay. And you are tired as well. <laughs> so, um, I guess I'll see you soon. Yeah. Just a couple of pairs. <laughs> well, I'm that's it, like, so. Yeah, then the other three. You feel like you're fast. I like this. Don't <laughs> go. <Don't> <laughs> it's easy, right? Yeah, very easy, very easy. Okay, this is getting harder. Let's see. Okay, no, no, let me play this. Like you told me. Oh, babe. Uh, my belly. Thank you. I need to empty my power. I'll be with you soon, baby. Spend the night here. Yeah? I'm sorry, not today. You don't want to move in with me. Spending a few nights here wouldn't kill you. I can't today. Oh my god, this isn't funny anymore. And honestly, I am really getting pissed. What is wrong with you spending the night here? What's the big deal? Well, the truth is, I'm running the night shifts today. Night shift? Night shift? Baby, baby, you don't run the night shift. You have staff who do that for you. You don't need to be there. You said that you're just finding reasons to avoid sleeping over. But I slept over last week and the week before. One night. Two. One night. Two. One night, babe. Fine. And the next morning, you went... You were up already and running away. What is it you are telling me? Please, can you just understand? I can't today. Why? Well, I have to be at the office really early tomorrow and spending the night here would mean I'll be stuck in traffic. <sighs> oh, baby. You know you're going to be my wife soon. We, we shouldn't be having this conversation right now. Of course. I'm sorry. I'll make it up to you. I'll spend a weekend here one of these days and I promise. Hmm. Oh, mm. you're just saying that. Because I'm serious. Mm. Oh, yeah. No, thank you, sir. Oh, 
Oh, so sorry for keeping you waiting. Uh, it's fine. How are you? I hope you've been taking your medication. Yes, I am. Okay. So you're here for your routine checkup, right? Yes. And, um, Doc? Yeah? Any hope? I'm sorry, Sonia. It's a long waiting list. But I'm positive something will come. Okay. But in the meantime, just take your medications and please pray. Just pray. I'm sure something will come. Hi, baby. I will need a favor. I'm oh, sure. I can't get off work today. Please help me pick up Princess from school and take her to the house. Oh, that's fine. I'm taking her to your house, right? Yeah. Okay. Thanks a lot, baby. Mm, you're welcome. Oh, I still have time. Baby, I came home the other day on my visiting day, but there was no one at home. I called your daddy and he didn't take my calls. Oh, maybe you were at Santa Sonia's house. Why do you guys go there so often? She could move in. Why shuttle between here? And a house. She prefers it like that. Oh. So. She spent the night here? No, just once or twice. But you guys go there to spend the night? No. <sighs> Baby. There's something she's hiding. She's hiding something really bad. What kind of a woman doesn't spend a night in a man's house? She doesn't want me to know. Did you see how she was looking at me? She didn't even say hi to me. She doesn't want me here. Listen to me. She wants to separate us, okay? So you have to be careful. Hmm? Mommy, hmm? I saw something at Auntie Sonia's house the other day. What is it? What? I saw her lying down on her kitchen floor. Like she was sleeping. Yes, yes. Yes. She was sleeping. You know, everyone sleeps at night. Yes, except for witches and cross. Hey, princess. Listen to me. Promise me that you'll be very careful. Okay? I'll be praying for you and your daddy. Okay? That witch will not win. I will pray for you. Hmm? <laughs> yes. Excuse me, mommy. I need to go and pee. Okay. Sorry, baby. Shoot, bitch. How 
rich. Coming from a slut who shamelessly walked away into my man's life. You belong to the street. Go back to where you belong. Don't touch me! Ah! Ah! Get off! Oh my god! You want to hit me? Beat me! Beat me! Because I came to see my child! What am I doing to you? You so wicked! You know what, baby? I have had enough of this mess! See what she's doing to me? Princess! Go in! See what she's doing to me? I'm telling you, this is going! This is wicked! I don't want to see when I get back here. Go in. There goes my princess. Princess, why are you crying? Baby, Sonia hates me. What? What did you do? I wanted to go see mommy. Oh, come here. Sorry. It's okay. Welcome. What happened? Why is Princess crying? Ask her, she's right there. She said you beat her. I did what? Princess, why would you say a thing like that? Well, leave the child alone and talk to me. Why? The child is clearly lying. Why would you say that about my child? My child is no liar! My child is no liar, okay? P Princess! I see you already believe her. Fine. Hey, 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 hey. come on. I'm trying to have a conversation here right now, okay? Why looks like you're the coming? I did not stand a chance with her. I'm not even going to bother trying to defend myself. I'm leaving. Sonia, I'm talking to you. Sonia! I talked to Princess. She lied about everything. I'm sorry. Forgive me. Forgive us. I didn't believe you. I'm sorry. The fact that you will think that I hate Princess for no reason at all is what baffles me. You know, I'm disappointed because I thought you knew me well enough. I'm sorry. I, I am sorry. Please forgive us. I, I was in a different place and uh, I... I'm sorry I didn't believe in you. Forgive me. Mm. 
It's fine. I miss you so much. I miss you too. Okay, whose son is it? My turn. All right. Oh. <laughs> hit me, hit me, hit me. <laughs> I told you I'm winning this game. Let's go. Sonia. Yeah? Are you okay? You, you, you seem lost, distracted. <sighs> Yeah, it's just, um, a lot has been happening. A lot? What's going on? It's Princess. Yeah. Princess has been acting up. And when she throws these tantrums, I don't know what to do. It's really affecting my relationship with Victor. To the extent he accused me of hitting her. What? Hitting her? That's... That's wild. How did you even come about that? So I was at Victor's place the other day and... Her mom came around. I decided to offer her a drink. But can you believe that this woman intentionally let the glass fall and she wasn't even apologetic <laughs> to top it all she called me a whore wait what it, I mean coming from a drug addict who almost killed her own child that's wild I mean even I would have given her a piece of my mind no it took the grace of God for me to keep my cool and at some point I just I was I, I was peace I, I asked her to leave and that's it just wasn't the whole case because Princess did not want her to leave. I had to literally force Princess into the house. And it somehow turned me into the devil. She even lied to her father that I hit her. That's crazy. That's... No, it's just... She's been acting different and it's disturbing. It's okay. Huh? You know, Princess, she has Victor wrapped around her little thumb. It's crazy because even I know you will never hit her. <laughs> Tell that to Victor. Hey, I'm sure he knows that as well. I mean, Victor is just conflicted. That's all. Hmm? Well, I'm tired. Okay? That woman pisses me off and I really don't need all this drama. In my life right now. I don't. It's okay. Hmm? Don't let Princess or her mother rile you up. Just do everything you can to avoid them. Okay? Alright? Miss Cheer up. Are you. Are you sure you're good? Are you sure you're okay? Yeah. <laughs> Easy, easy, easy. I must have passed out, right? Yes, you did. Take it easy with that hand, please. It's okay. Does this happen often? My God. Good day, ladies. Good day, doctor. Oh, I see you up.
me see. Okay. You know your passing out is not as a result of exhaustion or dehydration. Sometimes these fainting spells, they're nothing to be worried about. But yours is something to be very concerned about. Um, doctor, what exactly is wrong with my friend? She has coronary heart disease, which she is aware of. Sonia, what is she talking about? Are you aware of what she just said? What? You didn't tell me. Doctor, please, what does this mean for her? She has to undergo a heart transplant. Jesus. Well, she's already on the donor recipient list. My God. Thank you, Doctor. I'll take it over from here. Try to relax, okay? And please take it easy, we have. You'll be fine. Sonia. Sonia, why, why didn't you say... Why didn't you tell me? Why didn't you say something to me? I'm your friend. I couldn't bring myself to tell you. And Victor, does he know? No. That's why I barely sleep over at his place. I'm afraid I might have an episode and everything will come out. Sonia, you have to tell him. He has to know. You have to tell him. India, I can't. I will for sure, but not now. When? Oh my god, I'm, I'm so I'm so scared. I'm so scared. So baby, tell me how was good today. Fine. It was fine. Did you miss mommy? Yeah. How much? Uncountable. My baby. <laughs> I missed you <clears throat> so. <sighs> I want to talk to your daddy. Okay, thank you. Hi, Victor. Hi. Your girlfriend sent me out the other day. I'm sure she has a reason. What? And you deserved it. Really? What you see now? Because I'm way better than her. Come on, Tessa. Stop making this about you. We used to be so good. So good. What did I miss? The part where you almost killed our child. Or is it the part where you left our child at the back seat and you went into your supplies house to get I your record contains a whole lot of negligence and infant endangerment. You should be serving a jail term. I already apologized. What else do you want from me? Did you come here and go without creating problems? A 
Victor. That's all I do. That is all I do. I just come and go after seeing my child. She came at me and then I was confused. I was confused. Victor, you were confused. Yeah. You know better, Victor. You know Tessa, you know better. You know what pisses me off. I know what Tessa is doing and I let her get to me every time and she wins. She wins. Wait, wait. What are you talking about? Can't you see? Can't you see she's trying to manipulate you? She succeeded in manipulating Princess. She feels like you're with terrible things about me and what can I do? I'm not her mother. Princess is just a child. Well, good radiance then. <laughs> then I need to set new rules, okay? If she has to see Princess, then she has to start behaving. She doesn't need to get high. She needs to be sober. She can't just come to my house and create problems. Look at what she created. Look at us. I'm sorry. All I want is just to love you. I just want to love you and spend as much time as I can with you and Princess. But Princess wouldn't even talk to me. I see the way she looks at me. I'll talk to her. She doesn't have to be the problem. I am the problem. And I'm sorry. Okay? I'm deeply sorry. No. You hurt me. You hurt me. I'm sorry. Sonia! 
Sonia! Sonia! Sonia, let me see my child! Sonia! Let me see my child! I will break this guy down! I'm not joking! Shut up! Leave me alone! I want to see my child! Tell her I want to see my child right now! Please God, thank you! Go down! Let me see my child, Sonia! Leave me alone! Sonia! Let me see my child! You are not a mother, that is why! You don't know what it is to be a mother! Let me see my child! Please, please, you have to go in. You can't see this. Please, Sonia, please let her in. Let me see my I'm really sorry, but your dad insisted that no one please. let her in. Let I'm sorry. Sonia, please. Princess. Sorry. <sighs> Sonia, you are a bitch. You are evil. I will deal with you. Wait. Wait for me. Wait for me. Oh, you go. Hey, leave me alone. Princess. Let's give you a knockout. Where is Mr. Teddy? In the head. Um, the one is one thing. I'm gonna pause you. This is a video of your assignment. Don't make me seize those toys. Yes. Yes, what? Yes, I have done my assignment. Okay. I'll go check. Your dad called and he insisted I make sure you do your assignment. He said your teacher has been complaining that you brought back your homework exactly as she gave you yesterday. So I'll ask you again. Have you done your assignment? No. Princess, why did you lie? I don't like it when you tell lies. Good children do not lie. I'll have to take your toys from you while you go upstairs to your room and do your assignment. Please go to your room. of this. Why will you create a mess? You know very well that the housekeeper is not coming this weekend, so why will you create this mess? Who do you expect to clean this? I'm talking to you, young lady. Answer me. You're not my mother. Now you will clean that up before I smack you into oblivion. How dare you speak to an elder like that? Is that how I train you? Answer me! Now you listen here, young lady. Come here. Listen here. Hey, now you listen to me. See that woman over there? She is like a mother to you. She bit you. She fed you. She took care of you when you were sick. And you would not disrespect her. You do not ever raise your voice again. This is my house. She's not my mother. Would you shut up. I'm talking to you. And you would never raise your voice at an elder or disrespect them. Am I clear? Am I clear? Now you go there and clean up everything. 
Because you messed it up and you will clean it! It's fine. I'll do it. Go to your room. Baby, come on. If you do that, you spoil it. Baby. You don't. Yes. Uh, baby, um, you, you, can you stay over tonight? I have to be at the office really early. Oh, okay, it's fine. Uh, but you just, just um, help me clean this up so you can go home before it's too late. I, 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 can't, I can't just believe, I, I, I just can't believe this, like, oh my God. Have you visited the hospital recently? Yeah, but there's nothing yet. I'm at the bottom of the donor recipient list. There's nothing you can do. All we can do now is pray. Oh my God, I am so sorry. I'm so sorry, okay? L listen, I'm praying for you, okay? And I believe that very soon, God will give us a miracle. Okay, I'm sorry. It's okay. Thank you. Yeah. Please let me know when your next checkup is, okay? I'd love to go with you. I'm just I'm just worried you haven't told him. I will tell him, but not now. When? I'm, I'm just scared he might he might leave me. I'm scared I might lose him when he finds out. No man wants to be with a sick and dying woman. No, no, don't, come on, don't say that. You're not dying. Don't say that. You should tell him. Listen, he might shock you. Okay? Please. It's okay. okay. You shouldn't be going through all of this. Uh, that should be Victor. He's you sure you can I? Can I Darling, come on. Mm. Wow, how are you? Fine. I can see that. Hi, Victor. Hi. Hi. Uh, we hit cross path again. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> how are you? And how is Nigeria treating you? <clears throat> Nigeria. Let's just say I'm surviving the day. <laughs> surviving Lagos, flexing everywhere. Flex Lagos. <laughs> Princess, Princess, your food is ready. Princess, come here. I, I have to be in my room. My head aches. Please don't, don't go out, okay?
you smell weird. Yeah, I know. Um, I just came to take you out for a stroll. But Auntie Sonia said I should not leave the house. And Auntie Sonia and Dad will not be happy that you came here. Uh, where is Sonia? She's upstairs sleeping. You see? <laughs> okay. You see? She won't know that you went out with me. She's sleeping. <laughs> it's just... It's just me and you. Mother and daughter's time. Hmm? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So... It's okay. Are you okay? Mm-hmm. You, you, you're burning. Maybe we should go to the hospital. No, no, please. Uh, I'm fine. I'm just a little tired. Are you sure? Because you have been tired a lot lately. I'm fine, okay? Mm. How was work? Uh, work was time in, you know, uh, trying to snag a new investor, but it was futile. Oh, yeah. I'm sorry. Don't worry, better look next time, okay? Yeah. Where's Princess? I didn't see her downstairs. I left her downstairs. But she's not downstairs. I left her up there. I in the backyard. Oh my god. Hey. It's okay. Doctor, please, how is my heart doing? I'm sorry. What's not doing fine? You need that transplant urgently. And all I can do is wait. I mean, the list is incredibly long. But I'm doing my best to get to the top of it. It's a miracle you're still here. Well, my prayers are not in vain. Thank you, Doctor. But please, keep trying for me. I will. How was school today? School was okay. Fine. <gasps> Princess, I love your turtleneck. Who got that for you? Auntie Sonia. Oh, you see? 
Auntie Sonia is very kind. I mean, she buys you beautiful things. She spoils you. Hmm. But princess, Aunt Sonia is not happy. Hmm? You know that, right? Look at me, baby. She said you have refused to speak to her. Now, why is that? Why? Listen, princess. You see, in life, some people don't have mummies at all. You know that? No, they don't. But look at you. You have two mummies. You have your mummy and Auntie Sonia. Aren't you lucky? <laughs> Listen, princess, you should care for Auntie Sonia while you still can, okay? I mean, what if you wake up tomorrow and she's nowhere to be found? What would you do? Where is Auntie Sonia going? Is she leaving us? <laughs> no, she's not. I didn't say that. I said, what if? Hmm? You never know. So while you still can, hug her, kiss her, you know, show her all the love in this world. I know you've got it in you. Hmm? I want you to do something for me, really. What is that? Okay. I want you to love Auntie Sonia. Love her, care for her, kiss her, hug her whenever you get the chance. Okay. Princess, have I asked you for anything before? Have I? Have I? This is the first, right? You see? So you do that for me. Would you do that for me? You will, right? You're a good kid. I know you will. Okay? I know you might not understand all of this now because you're a kid. But I promise you, you will when you grow up. When you're like me. You would understand. Hmm? You're a good kid. And I love you. I love you so much. Do not let anyone rob you of your sweet childhood, okay? You're so cute, you know that, right? Come on, chip. Have. Yes! What are you doing here? Victor, I came to play with you to let me see my child. I am sorry you lost that right. Victor, I'm sorry. I haven't seen Princess in two weeks. Like, what do you want me to do for you? Huh? Can you just leave? Babe! Just leave! Like, just leave! Babe! What? Who is it? <laughs> my baby, come here. <laughs> I miss you. Sonia, please. Please, I beg you, let me see my child. Please, I'm come, begging come. you, please. It's fine. Huh? Stand up. I forgive you. What? Baby, I, baby, are you joking? Baby, like... baby, please. Just let her see her child. But this time around, you're staying in the living room. <laughs> fine. But just for now. Thank you, Auntie Sonia. Thank you, Daddy. Uh, Sonia, thank you so much. <laughs> hey, come here. I've missed you so much. Let's go inside. I just want out. Huh? Let's go. What was that about? What was what about? You forgiving her like that. Babe. <sighs> Refusing to forgive her will only make me the bad person she's been painting me to be. Especially in front of princes. I'm not going to let that happen. Besides, I don't want to hold on to grudges. We really don't know how much time we have here on Earth. To begin with, you are not going anywhere. Secondly, 
Tessa deserves your grudge, you know. She hasn't been any exemplary human being either. I know. But holding on to a grudge will not change anything. Thank you. Thank you for forgiving her. Spend a weekend here. Uh, come on, and I would not accept a no this time. I'm sorry, I can't. No, you can. You can, babe. Come on. Hmm? See, uh, please. Spend a weekend here. Please. Stay. I am. Was it? You're keeping something for me? Of course not. Then spend the weekend here. Well, I assumed that you were keeping something for me, and believe me, I would do everything in my power to find out what it is. So what's it gonna be, huh? Are you going to spend a weekend here? Or you want me to look into it? Fine, I'll stay. Great. And I am not keeping anything from you. Great. <laughs> Come here. So I'm taking this, you are going nowhere, and putting it back there, and we are going downstairs, great. Right? <laughs> you see how they made me beg them like a pauper, so I could see you. Sorry, mommy. It's okay. Hey, listen. Sonia is not a good person. You see how she let me go on my knees first before she pleaded on my behalf. She embarrassed me, your mom. Anyways, it's okay. There's nothing I won't do for you. Mommy, why are we whispering? Honey, we need to keep our conversations low. <laughs> Some people may not understand what we're saying, so they may read meanings into our words, or even yours. Hey, bad meanings. She made your mom beg. No good person can keep a child away from their mother. No. No good person. Do you understand? Yes. Listen. No matter how nice she seems, she doesn't love you. Yes. And soon. Soon. Soon she will take your daddy away from you.
Christmas. Daddy, I'm scared. You're scared? Come on. Come here. Come here. Come, come, come. Daddy's here, okay? Sleep. Princess. Princess, your food is ready. But I don't want noodles. You will have to manage this. This order is available. I don't want noodles. Look, I don't have time for this. Eat your food. I will not. Fine. Suit yourself. Mm, you don't want to feed me. You just want to keep me hungry because I cannot cook. You're making me so sad. Here we go, please. Look, I am not ready for <laughs> Quickly, stop it, stop, 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 stop it! Fine, what, what, what do you want? Jello fries and fried chicken. <sighs> oh, oh, okay, fine, I'll make it, I'll make it! I'll make it! Oh. Come, come here, it's okay. It's okay, I'll make it, I'll make it! Who else? Hey. Princess, you okay? Is the noodles ready, babe? Yes. I was just about to call you. It's here. Oh. You okay? Oh. Okay, high five. Okay. <laughs> <sighs> God, God, please don't let this happen here. Oh, please. With you. I've been eating. I'm very hungry. Have you been eating? No, Auntie did not give me food. Okay. Take. Uh, okay. Let me have a good day. Thank you. I like it. Yes. How do you. What are you doing, princess? Eating with my daddy. But I thought you said you did not want to eat noodles. Answer me when I'm talking to you. What the hell? Princess. Princess, princess, princess! Babe, babe, babe. 
This girl is becoming something else. What do you expect? When you decided not to give her food, what do you expect? Jeez. I what? I didn't give her food. Me. The princess said she did not want to eat noodles. And despite how tired and exhausted I am, I went into that kitchen to make jollof rice and fried chicken for her. And this is what I get in return. Princess, what happened? Did you tell Auntie Sonia you didn't want noodles? Honey, why did you lie to me? Huh? Princess, good kids don't lie. You heard Auntie Sonia. You know how much she loves you. You hurt her feelings. I am truly disappointed in you. I truly am. I trained you better than that. You know that, princess. And I told you to always tell the truth. And a lying tongue will always ruin everything for you. I'm sorry, Daddy. It's okay. Come. Come. It's fine. Okay? It's okay. So this is what I want you to do. I want you to apologize to Aunt Sonia tomorrow. Okay? Big girl, I love you. Come here. Come here. It's okay. All right? Sorry. Forgive me. Forgive us. Please, honey. She's just a kid. And uh, you and I know that kids act before they think. I know I heard you. And I'm, and I'm begging for your forgiveness. Forgive me to forgive Princess. I, I'm, I'm not justifying what she did because she's a child. But honestly, I am disappointed in what she did. I don't know what got into her. I, I, I don't know why she could just lie to me in the face, but I am sorry. I'm deeply sorry. You should have known better. Please, baby. Please. Mm. 
We've been together for almost a year now. And never for once have I starved Princess. Why would I do that now? I mean, though I've bathed her, but she is like a daughter to me. I would do anything to make that girl happy. I break my back for her. What else do you want from me? I'm sorry. I'm deeply sorry. Please. This is for the place in your heart to forgive us. I love you. Princess loves you. We love you. She adores you. Please. Please. I will do better next time. Sonia, please forgive me. I'm sorry for the way I behaved. It's okay. Well, you know you can always talk to me, right? Whatever it is. Good. Are you ready for breakfast? Yes, Auntie Sonia. Okay, why don't you go to the living room and breakfast will be ready in a minute. Okay. See the way she talks to me. She looks down on me and rubbishes me in front of you. Listen. Sonia is a bad person. But Auntie Indy says that people who speak behind people's back are toxic. And Auntie Sonia has never said anything bad about you behind your back to me. But you keep on saying mean things about her. Is Auntie Indy. Auntie Sonia's friend. Come here. Listen. I am your mother. They're trying to paint me bad. They want you to hate me. They want to separate us. Baby, can't you see? They're all working together. Can't you see everything that I'm telling you? Can you see it? Oh, no, mom, you're hurting me. Ah, my baby. 
baby, I'm so sorry. I just want you to understand that these people are feeding you with poison. And you're too young to know good from bad. Listen to me. Listen. Listen to me. Listen. I am your mother. And I'm telling you the truth. Because I love you. I want you to listen. Okay? Do you understand? Do you understand? Baby. You have to understand because I'm the... I'm the only one that truly loves you. I'm the only one. And that's because I am your mother. So you have to listen to me. I love you. I have to tell him. He has every right to know. I cannot continue to keep this away from him. something to tell you. Okay. Um, come, come, come. Okay. Tell me about it. Hey, Princess. Princess. just been busy. Busy? Doing what? I mean, you can't be busy doing anything because you should avoid anything that is going to strain you. I will. Please, just um, come in for checkup as soon as possible. It's important. Thank you, doctor. What is that? It's my doctor. He called to give me feedback on a test I did. A test? Honey, what test? I want to test. I guess it was. Negative, that's why you didn't mention. Sorry, babe. Oh, it's okay. No, it's all right. Sorry. Hey, babe. I thought you were bringing Princess over. I haven't seen you guys. Can you believe Tessa came to the school to pick up Princess without informing me? I've been driving around for an hour looking for them. I'm so pissed right now. Um, have you gone to her house? Yes! And no one is there. Her car isn't parked there too. I am really worried, babe. Oh, okay, just babe, take it easy. Babe, you know what? Let me just call you back.
Something is this cow. Okay. Are you sure? Yes. I swear to God, I die. I don't ever want to see her again. Ever again. Oh, <sighs> Babe. It's okay. It's okay. Hmm. I'm sorry, okay? I went through hell, right? I know. But the good thing is she's back. Yeah. Why don't you come up and freshen up? Sure. Let's go. Princess. Oh, when you are mine, nothing is impossible for love, for love. When you are mine, I will cross the ocean, no fear, no fear. I'll go the distance, I'll write you a love song. My beautiful baby, for you I will stay strong. I'll go the distance. I'll write you Happy a love birthday song. To my beautiful angel. Happy birthday. You, my Happy birthday. Happy birthday. You Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Oh, 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 oh. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Hold on, hold on. Come here. That's it for our <laughs> birthday girl. <laughs> I can't believe my baby is nine years old. <laughs> the girl is a big girl, not a small little baby. Ah, that's my girl. <laughs> well, I want to make a wish. Okay. Go ahead. <sighs> Woo! Happy birthday! <laughs> uh, yes, what did you wish for? I wish that Auntie Sonia would be my mommy. out a series of tests on Miss Sonia and they all come back the same. So what's the result saying? She has coronary heart disease. Heart disease? Yeah. Heart. You know this? I'm sorry. I was scared. You're scared of what? That you would leave me. No one wants to be with a dying woman. 
dying? Yes. So? She has barely three months to live. Her heart is failing because of a fatty substance in the heart. I mean, there's no blood flow to the heart anymore. And um, the only way to save her right now is to find a donor, which would actually give her heart. I'm pretty sure you're aware of this. Is that what he wanted to tell me the other night? Yes. Jeez. Anyway, I have a patient registered in this hospital. She has glioblastoma, an aggressive form of brain tumor. She has barely 9 to 12 months to live and she's willing to donate her organs. Spoke with her yesterday and uh, she's willing to give it out. Wait, can an organ from a cancer patient be safe? Uh, well, yes. Yes. I mean, the risk of cancer transfer to the other person is really very minimal. Uh, this is a good shot, I mean, if you're willing to take it. I'm telling you this because I've known you for quite a long time. Uh -huh. Although there are similar patients uh, with the same condition as your your wife, wife. Yeah, yeah. She really has to survive this, so I can make this official. Thank you so much, Doctor. You're welcome. Thank you. God You're bless welcome. you. Uh, I'll leave you guys now. I'll right. leave my office. Hey. There's still chance. Hi. Still chance, baby. Daddy. Hey. This is it going to be okay? Yeah. Come on. You'll be fine. You'll be fine. Princess. Are you all right? Daddy, is Auntie Sonia going to be okay? Is she going to go to heaven like Grandma? What? No. Come here. No. Come here. No. Hey, see, Auntie Sonia is not going anywhere. Your Auntie Sonia will be fine and she will not leave us. All right? I sure, because Grandma left us and I really miss her. I miss her too. Hmm? But Auntie Sonia is not going to heaven. Okay? She is too young. And she has so much to do. I promise? I promise, honey. Well, well, I'm not God, but I will do everything in my power to make sure that she stays here with us, okay? Mm -hmm. Come here, come here. Now, who is hungry? Me, Dad. But you don't know how to cook, and you make your noodles like a pup. My God! How rude can you be to your poor dad? <laughs> okay, how about rice? Oh, God. Auntie Sonia, please come and save me. Well, Auntie Sonia is not yet to save you this time. Now, you are stuck with me. You're going to eat pop noodles. Oh, God. I commit my precious tummy into your hands. <laughs> You are going to eat pop noodles. No! Yes! Auntie Sonia! Oh, no, 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 she's gonna get. Sonia, I got this. It's beautiful. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. 
Well, I told you that you were going to be my wife. And I'm not backing out now that you're sick. Because we are going to go through this together. Through the thick and thin. For better or for worse. And no sickness shall do us apart. This this reassurance that is you and I against the world. And I know that you will beat this. Amen. Will you marry me? Now I'm going to be my mommy. Yes, mommy, <laughs> officially. Yes. Oh Congrats, guys. Daddy, I want to donate my heart to Auntie Sonia. Um, um, princess, come here. Mr. Victor. Hey. Oh. Is everything okay? We have a heart. Oh. Oh. oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god, babe! Oh my god! Did you hear the news? We have a heart! Congratulations! Uh, how come? You remember the lady I told you about? Uh, the lady with the brain. Oh, yes, yes. Yeah, she's at peace now. God. But she requests that her hearts be given to me, and you. We are internally grateful to her. Well, let's prep for theatre. Okay. We'll be in one hour. Thank you, Thank you so much, Dr. I'm right. I'll see you. All right. Thank you so much. Thank you. Together, under the rain and skies, we were two lovers laughing together. I said.